is a sketch comedy podcast show. Tonight on Sorters with your host, Chad Williamson. Chad Williamson out here in front of the house of Mary Lou Johnson, and we're about to get her sorted. Let's get up to the front door and see exactly what we've got to deal with tonight. Hello? Hi, Mary Lou. My name's Chad. What What are you doing here? What do you want? We're here to help you sort. I, I don't want any of my things thrown out. Oh, no, no. You misunderstand. We're not throwing anything out. We're just organizing tonight. Come on, let's step into the foyer and see what we've got. Oh, okay. Well, careful stepping over all the old aquariums. I don't want you to get cut. Oh, those aquariums are gorgeous. And you know what'll make a great thing is if we put a little, if we stack these aquariums right here, uh-huh. we'll make a nice dividing wall to really kind of separate the old newspapers away from the old Time magazines. Oh, Chad, that's so wonderful. I've been telling everybody for years that they would have a purpose. Thank yes, you. Yes, exactly. Hold on a second. Is that cat feces I smell? It is. I've been collecting them in old Safeway bags for years. Oh, fantastic. You know, uh, a lot of people don't realize this, but you can use cat feces to kind of create a um, like a piece of furniture. So if we stack the... Fr- the cat feces bags over here Mm -hmm. in just such a way look at this it's almost like a cat feces uh, Uh, like bean bag right like come over here and try it and you've got so many different colors it just Uh, really goes with the bottles of puke that you have uh, saved right over here notice that and it's so comfortable too yeah and you know what it's got that familiar smell you're used to it really does but see no I feel like you're a miracle miracle worker and you've done so much already but I have another pile to show you. Oh, let's let's go take a look. Oh, wow. Um so I stopped paying my water bill about 8 years ago. Okay. And since then I've been wearing adult diapers and yes, I Yes, I can them. see and smell and almost taste it. Yes. I I don't know what to do with them. I don't want to throw them away. They're no, part they're of me. special to your heart. They and are, and I try to tell my kids. They try to throw it away, and I try to tell them that. And it's you feel important. like they're trying to throw away the diapers, just like they're trying to throw away you. I totally they understand. Are. So what we're gonna do is we are going to find a way to keep these diapers. Uh, we are gonna find a way to keep these diapers after this commercial break. Have you moved far from home? Has your mother passed away? Now you can feel like your mom is with you for all of your movie watching experiences with Movie Buddy Mom. With just one click, you can relive the experience of watching a movie with the person who went through labor for you. Features include non-stop talking, irrelevant questions, and plot solving. From the current hits... Oh, the Sandra Bullock, just so stunning. Flawless, really. Who couldn't love her? I uh, guess that Butch Cassidy kid. Oh, can you imagine breaking her heart? Oh, such a sweetie. Ah, uh, did I tell you I saw your cousin Amanda at the grocery store? You need to give her a call. Two incredible storylines. Oh, that Leonardo DiCaprio. What a cutie. It's just too bad he's not settled down yet. So, I'm not quite clear. No. Why are they floating around? Are they in that uh, Jerry Gordon, Third Rock boy? They're in his brain or something? Fighting? Is that what's happening? And all-time classics. Have you ever fucked on cocaine? Can you believe that Sharon Stone is pushing 60 nowadays? Do you believe this? She looks fabulous here in this dress. Oh, my gosh. I'll forget about it. What is she? Oh, my. Oh, my God. Is that her hoo Order today, and as a bonus, every movie will also contain the bonus material, Wasn't She In? And, boy, they're getting old. Movie Buddy Mom, for those times when you miss your mother, but not enough to visit. And now back to Sorters with your host, Chad Williamson. So far tonight, Chad has worked some miracles with Mary Lou Johnson. He's taken old aquariums and turned them into a dividing wall. He's turned old bags of cat feces into a beanbag chair. Yet, he has his largest challenge ahead of him yet. 
Piles of eight-year-old diapers waiting to find a use. Now back to Chad. All right, Mary Lou, you know what? Uh, I was a little worried. I was looking through the piles of piles and piles of adult diapers. Um, and one of the things I noticed was that as they got older, they started to yellow because they were rotting. Oh, uh-huh. That actually works to our advantage because uh-huh. what we're going to do is we have so much both diaper and solid material that it is actually an approved building material. And so what we're going to do is we are actually going to create in this room, we're going to be able to build some retaining walls and we're actually going to be able to um, add on to your house. So you'll not only have uh, the diapers, but you'll also have another room that you can put more stuff in. And I noticed that you have that entire collection of that entire Smurf collection, mm-hmm. the uh, the Happy Meals uh, that look like they have not been eaten. No, I saved all the food inside as well. And as you'll see, it it hasn't molded or anything. No, and it really does kind of cut the smell from the the adult diapers in here. So. We've got a lot of really good work to do, but uh, we're going to take a little time to do it. So uh, let's get uh, some of these things gathered up and figure out exactly where we're going to put that extra room. Oh, Chad, I can't thank you enough for all your help today. Oh, you don't have to thank just me. You'll have to thank the entire crew of sorters as soon as they get back from the bathroom from dry heaving. 